Hello. Do you do you hear me? I turn down that mic. This mic. This mic. Yeah, turn it down. Because I recorded about an hour and a half of footage with it yesterday or the day before. It was up way too high, so the audio was terrible. I nearly killed myself. But I think I can salvage it. Anyway, hello, 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 hello. Let me know in the chat if you can hear me. I've got no way of really listening to myself at the moment. Hang on. Oh, actually, I have. Can I hear myself on here? Um, hello. Success, yes, I've got your, your thing has been sent. Hope you got it okay. Do you do hear me? I, I don't hear me. That's weird. Hang on. Good, Tosh, thank you. At least someone's helping me out here. <laughs> Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Good. So today, we are going to be changing a theme. We're going to be flipping, or well, getting ready for flipping anyway. Get ready to flip a knowledgeable mind. I don't know why I said it like that. Good, thank you everyone for letting me know that I'm loud and clear. That's perfect, good. Phil's in the house. And Mark, thank you. And Sue and Jazzy and Wabistics. How's your Bitcoin going? To the moon and back. Don't know if it's coming back. We don't want it to come back. Just to the moon and then on to Mars. Well, maybe I'm getting a little ahead of myself with the flipping. But um, you're yeah, getting it ready to flip for sure. And just to add an extra bit of excitement on a Friday, I'm going to be doing it on the site, on, on a live site. No maintenance mode plugins. We're just going to be doing it. Just doing it. Live dangerously. YOLO. YOLO. That's what I say. Sometimes. Who else have we got? Bradbury. Hello. Brian. Uh, Jamie and Jason. Hello to you. Jazzy. Uh, Johnny, I've already seen you. Hello, Mark. Uh, Mercutius. Um... Yeah, YOLO. Bear me two seconds. Sorry about that, technical problems, but it should be all right now. I didn't go for a wee. I will be going for one later, though, I'm sure I just had a big tea. Anyway, yeah, let's get on with it, let's get on with it. Okay, hello, 24K Will. Nomad Alex, nice name. So here's the site, let's go have a look at it. Oh, no, not that one. That one. <sighs> Here we go. God, this chair's noisy. So, yeah, this is the site. I paid $600 for it. Um, actually, 
I haven't checked the AdSense recently, all the analytics. Let's have a quick look at it. Now, someone commented the other day that I shouldn't really be showing AdSense. Don't know why. Is that naughty? Google don't like that. Um, bu -bu 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 knowledgeable mind. I don't know why I keep saying it like that, that's weird. Uh, reports, sites, um, last 30 days. Let me just bring up the analytics, then I will put my screen back on. I know I've turned it off just for confidentiality reasons. Okay, here we go. <laughs> you think I'm gonna break it, Phil? Probably will. So what do we got? Um, I, I don't know my way around this new analytics. <laughs> One and a half users in the last uh, 30 days, so that's not too bad. It does seem to be slightly in decline. In terms of the money, 37 pence. So, I'll have my $600 back before you know it. <laughs> but anyway, I mean, my plans for the site are to build out this content. I'm trying to figure out exactly the sort of categories of content we're gonna go for. I know that the manifestation seems to be doing quite well. So thinking we could have something around life or spirituality or something like that. There's also quite a few posts on drawing things that seem to be quite popular. I mean, they're so random, the subjects on this site. Do tick style or I mean, nothing is connected. So it's whether I need to ditch some of this content because it's not particularly good content, if I'm honest. It's not particularly good content. So, um, Maybe get rid of summer, maybe just focus more on the manifestation and the numerology and law of attraction, hypnosis, all that kind of thing might be good. Hey, is your logo custom made? What this one, I guess it was, it came with the site. But anyway, what we're gonna do is we're gonna switch the theme today and just kind of tidy up a bit of this content. And the theme I'm gonna be switching to is the one that was recommended on a live stream a while back. It's called, what's it called? What, what is it called? It's called Rookie, Rookie, Ruku? Ruku, it's called Ruku, isn't it? No, it's called, um, I don't know. Let me get it, I've already bought it. Why did you buy it? Says Brian. I, I felt sorry for the guy who had it. If I'm 100% if I'm honest. And I've been looking for a site to do a flip on. I'm looking for a site to do a flip on. And um, this guy contacted me. He said, I've got this site. And I'm going through hard times. I've got health problems. A few other things. And I really need uh, to get rid of my site. I need some money. And I was like, you know me. I'm a soft touch when it comes to things like that. Rookie mistake, that's how I can remember it, Bradbury. I knew there was a funny joke connected to it. Anyway, yeah, so they said they needed some money, they had health problems. I said, okay, what, what, what's the site? They sent me over the site. They said they wanted $1,000 for it, and I was like, ooh, $1,000. I said, I'll give you 600 for it. I thought, they're not gonna go for that. And he was like, yeah, yeah, fine. And then he immediately started transferring every, everything over to me, and it was a easy process. Phil helped me, of course, with it a little bit, and um, yeah. And then when I looked into it, the site is actually getting quite a bit of traffic, so I thought, well, it's not too bad. Narendra, hopefully you've just heard what I said, because I kind of explained. So yeah, guy contacted me out of the blue, said, I've got health problems, I've got some stuff going on, I really need some money, can you help me? I've got this site, do you want it? It's $1,000, I said uh, 600 he said fine, that was it. But anyway. I see that Invato, 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 Invato. You say Invato and I say Invato. Is that a thing? Um, I see that Invato are pushing SiteGround. 
got a little affiliate link going on there. A little affiliate link, and they've got a special landing page. Offer for Inveto users. Don't you always promote fry themes? Why the switch to Roku? Roku. Um, I don't always promote fry themes. I did in my last video, but before that, I was promoting Elementor and other things. I'm going with this one because, in theory, I should be able to get the site switched over really quick and easy. Well, actually, when I say easy, we're going to explore how complicated themes from Theme Forest are, and also. I feel like I should because Invato, <laughs> Invato, Invato, what should we say? Should we say Invato? Invato, I'm gonna go with Invato, it sounds better. Invato, no, Invato, definitely Invato. Invato said, um, will you have a look at some stuff, please make some videos maybe, and they put $100 credit in my account. Um, which I don't know where it's gone actually, I haven't spent all of it. Oh, there we go, current credit, $41 left. Um, yeah, so they sent me over $100, so I f feel like I should, and it's free money, sort of. No, no, it's, I'm gonna be using this thing. Let's get on with it, you'll see what I'll be doing. Download the theme, the rookie. Let's not make any rookie mistakes. I'm gonna use that joke all day, Bradbury. Um, have I got a folder for this on here? Yeah, Knowledgeable Mind. I think I've actually already downloaded it. Uh, though this looks different. Let's see if it's a different version. There is high commissions on SiteGround affiliate program and they have really good services. The service is good, yes, though they've hidden the support, which is not great. But it's so expensive, SiteGround. Narendra, are you on a delay or something? Maybe you need to forward the video because Everything I just say, you then ask the question about it. So, do, should I go over it again? I'm using Rookie because someone suggested it. I think it's gonna be really easy. It looks really good, and Invato gave me $100, so I feel like I should use it. How much I host Armada? Well, um, thank you for asking, 24K uh, Will. It's all right, Narendra, it's fine. I love you, really. She might be not, who's not live, I don't know. So Host Armada, they have some great offers starting at 3 99 a month. But if you use the code WPEagle75, let me show you. I go for the web warp because you can have unlimited sites. Uh, um, blah, 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 dot com. I just want to show you this discount that you can get. Uh, yes, thank you. Always go for a long one to get the best offer because you can lock yourself in on 469 for three years. Fantastic. Choose your data center. Get a discount WP Rocket now. Wow. Then what you want to do, there's this, they always put a code in for you. But you want to get that out of there. Get it out. Then go for WP Eagle 75. You can get three years hosting for unlimited websites for just $140. Phil, what is an inode limit? It sounds bad. Anyway, so there we go. Host Armada, check them out. Use WP Eagle 75. Right, so I've downloaded. Let's get on, otherwise we're gonna be here all afternoon, aren't we? Not unlimited, no, let me check the small print. Ah, okay, so they limit the number of files and folders you can have. Unlimited, see, there's no like asterisks or anything. They must have like some fair use thing you have to tick anyway. Robbie! 
I see, for best roof box, your load times for mobile are around 30. Are you not concerned? No, not concerned at all. You, you, you are sending me off on a tangent, no, that's fine. Um, what what are you using to measure my site? Is that is that Google PageSpeed? The site is already running um, WP Rocket. But yeah, I'm gonna be switching to Nitro Pack soon. I just gotta get around to making a video. Look at that traffic spike. We've got all this, this is all on. 35. What is it, some JavaScript, is it? Okay, it's the YouTube video. This one. But why is WP Rocket not switching it out? Um, uh, there was a thing with why it was doing this before. Does anyone remember? I'm good, Christian. There was a reason I think before why that video was not being switched out. Hang on, let me just, um, what am I doing? I just wanted to have a look, I, I'm getting confused. Say with a YouTube video, I'm, that might be here. Nearly. You haven't missed anything, I'm struggling to get going. Um, how strange, how strange. Let me just check something on that. Um, Okay, I don't know. It was, it wasn't doing it before, and then it was doing it, and now it's not doing it again. But yeah, you're right. Maybe just hide it on mobile. Thank you, Gordon. You know, you can you can make your very own site like we're long. You can get hold of the template as well. And they haven't made the featured image the right size. Oh gosh, we'll fix that. No, don't play that video. Did you hear it? It's got copyright music on it. Oh, it matters. I need to monetize this. I want to edit this column. Let's let's get rid of it on here. There we go. I think I've just improved my page speed score. No, no, we're not, Phil. Yeah, it was fake traffic, that big spike. Oh, I probably need to clear the cache, don't I? What's up with it on mobile? Let's have a look. Bum, 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 bum. I like the music, that video, but it's, it is copyright. Buttons are centered. Well, those ones are. Not using that anymore, Phil. Got rid of that. That Zoic thing. 
Anyway, we're, we're going off on a tangent. Let's do knowledge one mind. That's what we're here for. JP. I don't have a giveaway today. Still loading that YouTube stuff. Whatever, I can't be bothered with Google PageSpeed. It's a load of old baloney. Right, so I've downloaded, let's 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 install the theme. Let's do it. So um just gonna extract it. I don't think you can see me doing that. It was the same version. Anyway, I've extracted the the file I just downloaded from Theme Forest. I'm now going to go to Appearance and Themes. Exactly, Josh. I'm always all over the place. Is my I think I'm ADHD or something. Bradbury, we've been through this. <laughs> Someone approached me and said, do you want to buy my site? I've got help forums. I need some money. It's a thousand dollars. I felt sorry for them. So I said, I'll give you 600 and they said, okay. And that's it. Mm, so we're currently on Astra. Upload. Uh, in here, in here, there we go. Let's install this rookie. Bradbury, you, you tease. Lisa, Lisa, Lisa. I can't say any words right, can I really? Invato, Invato, Rookie, Rookai. <laughs> oh. Maybe, although if you go through Carl's program, you can sign up without any traffic. You've missed me going all over the place, not really getting anywhere, usual kind of stuff. So I've added the, the parent feed, let's up, no. No, no, no. Let's upload the child theme. And then activate and break the site. Well, there we go. Now let's install some plugins. That's a lot of plugins. That is the other thing with Theme Forest themes. They need a lot of plugins, which is that good or bad? I don't know. Probably bad. They're done, they're done. And now we must activate. You ever used to watch Robot Wars in the UK? Love Robot Wars. When they started fighting, they'd say, activate. Craig Charles, Sir Killalot was one of the, the bots. The robots. I loved Robot Wars. Okay, so we're, we're done. Should we have a look at if the site's broken? What what the I think I need to disable WP Rocket while I'm working on this. <laughs> that might be a, a good thing. Disable your cache your cache. Your caching plugins. In fact, let's go in here. We don't need all these anymore. Don't ask me why I'm deactivating. How cheeky. Like this. I don't think I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn this off. Um, I'm going to turn Element off. We don't need that anymore. Uh, I'm going to turn this off because it will probably block me. I'm going to turn this off. Uh, I, I don't know which plugins I just installed, so uh, I'm going to turn this off. Leave them. Turn this off. Get out, get out of here, all of you. Go. Right, we can turn more stuff off later. Uh, yeah. 
Dana, look, even Josh has got 20 plus plugins. I don't know how many plugins Jesus had, but yeah, look. Whoa! Look at it, it's looking better already. Woo! I think we're done. I'll see you later. No, maybe we need to just investigate a little bit more. I need some liquid. I need some more vodka. I love vodka when working on sites. So can you wear prescription glasses for drawing to improve your skills? Look at the content just looks so much better already. Although these big pins, we're gonna to have to do something with that. Ah, what's that video doing? It's, it's too big. We need to get rid of this. We're not doing paid posts. Not doing, well, do it. don't know if I like the font either, but we'll see. Hmm, see, generally the content, oh, you like the font. I like this font. What is this font? This is um, mullish. Mullish, what's mullish? I like this font, yeah, but then we got this font. I'm wondering if this has been added at the uh, the post level. Let's take a look. What are we, oh my God. Okay. Okay. It's It's gone, it's dirty. Dirty code. A lot of font families and stuff in here. Okay. Um, okay. It might, is it because I took Elementor off or is it just dirty? Yeah, Dana's, Dana's just passed out looking at that. Uh, what is this? What is this stuff? I'm gonna have to remove some more plugins, I think. Let's have a look. So was that nothing to do with Ele Elementor? Won't help me with that, will it? I'd rather not use Elementor if I can help it. This thing, advanced, we don't want this. Get rid of the you, you advanced editor tools. Previously tiny MCE advanced. Don't want you. Abort. Just use Gutenberg. Dana, I think you've just come up with another t-shirt idea right there. Okay, we're gonna have to, has anyone got any tips on how I can clean this mess up in a quick and efficient way? Here we go, Gutenberg, you're here to, well, then it's all in this big classic lump, oh God. I'm thinking I'm just gonna have to do a copy paste situation. Thinking that might be the best thing to do. Because this, has it still got font stuff on it? Um, what if I if I press convert to blocks, will that break it? Yeah, maybe start afresh. I think some of these articles are getting traffic, so. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, yeah, let's, I'm gonna refresh. So again, just like scoop it all out and then copy it back in slowly, surely. Like get it, get it all out. Um, put it somewhere like maybe in Word. Actually, let me just make sure that you can see what I'm doing. Then we'll just we'll just do it this way. Clean, clean, convert me to blocks. Get that's perfect. Uh, 
Not word. <laughs> Not word. Um, okay, I'll put it in word. Where, where should I put it, Dana? Word, word's fine. I'm going to... Note. I've, I don't have notepad. I've got text edit. I don't know if that will take the images, though. No. Because I want to know what the images were. Not that it matters, really. Don't worry, we'll be fine, we'll be fine. I've got Word here. I love, I love Microsoft Word. Let's go. Right, look, it's very simple, very simple. All we gotta do, all we gotta do is just start writing. Just get this, this here, pop it in. No, as I say, I'm gonna do a little paste and match style. Although WordPress should clean it up itself. Then what did we have? We had a little YouTuber, didn't we? A little YouTube. Like this, although I haven't said are these videos any good. The logo doesn't match anymore. Can you wear prescription glasses for drawing? Oh, it's the robot to man. Your skills. Visual Can you wear prescription glasses for drawing to improve your skills? Slightly, slightly Russian Kazakhstanian robot. Artists rely on several capacities of sight when drawing. When you draw in a physical or digital format, you use a unique combination of optical capabilities related to focus and perspective. To recognize the importance of good vision for drawing. Uh, what are we gonna do with, with this? What are we gonna do with these, this? I'm thinking maybe leave the YouTube videos out for now. I think YouTube, it did come with a YouTube channel. The guys give me access to it, but I think I might need to re rethink it. Get it out, get it out. Let's, let's not worry about that. Um, when you are drawing with your prescription glasses. Did who buy this website, Gordon? Gordon's alive. I did buy it. I've been through it only four times, five times. If you want to know how why I bought it, you can rewind the stream. So we've got this image of a of an eyeball. Kind of eye this this eye. Beautiful. How does acuity and focus work? Is that a heading? I guess that's a heading. Can we add a heading? Thank you. H2, go H2. Yeah, maybe Jason. But do we all want YouTube channels that are voiced by robots? Maybe. I'm not reading this content. I'm, I don't know how good it is, but I think as a you know as a start, I should probably keep the existing content on here. Well, then we've got a picture of some glasses uh, and a thing, then the thing. I might have to get Mac on this, my editor. He might have to do this because I know that I'm just not going to get around to cleaning up all these um, these posts. Then we've got a man. They've got a lot of stock images. I hope it's all licensed. Don't want any letters coming. There already are what good free good good um robot voices. What is teaming and tracking? Teaming is very bad. You get banned from the server for teaming. And then we need the eyeball, more a lot of eyeballs. I'm thinking it's that eyeball. Are the images optimized? Probably not. Well, we'll get smush on here later or something. Put that in. I'm not copying and pasting special, so I'm hoping there's not too much stuff from Word coming over. I don't think there's too much content on this site. I think there's only like 30 articles, so it's not gonna be too much trouble. There we go. Lady painting with her glasses on. Does having Perception and recognition better for you. 
Okay, there is gonna be some issues with these articles. I don't know where the guy has got them, or maybe he wrote them himself, but does having good perception and recognition better for your skills? That doesn't make sense. It's probably an is. It still doesn't make too much sense, but a little bit more sense. Working on knowledgeable mind. We've just switched the theme, is Ishmael. Does there really need to be, well, that's a good point, Dana. Does there need to be so many images? I don't know, I feel like there is, probably not. <laughs> there is a lot of images. Yeah, there's too many images, isn't there? Let's, let's not put so many images in. Where are you? Let's read some of this. Actually see if it's worth me copying and pasting. Wearing prescription glasses can improve your ability to represent abstract ideas or physical objects or subjects in lifelike or stylized drawings. I think that wins the world record for the number of ors in a sentence. Factor in how you draw, such as the distance of any models you rely on while drawing. The need to shift focus from near to intermediate or far ranges while drawing will determine the best type of corrective lenses. Yikes. Okay. Why can't I add another block now? There it is. I never really used Gutenberg, really. I don't know if I like it. Yes, I do. Thank you very much for your time. I've slipped into Borat. Let's have a look, shall we? That's true. I guess so. <laughs> yeah. No, it's, it's the question is, can you wear prescription glasses for drawing to improve your skills? Yeah, that, you're right, it doesn't really make sense. <laughs> That looks better now though, doesn't it? Even though the it, it's talking a load of old rubbish, really. Okay, now I've done that, I think I'm gonna delete this. <laughs> Let's have a look at the content first. I think we need a content clean out. How much have we got? 20, 20 articles. The categories we have are drawing, seven, manifestation, 11, ticks, one, writing one, okay. Let's have a look at analytics again. What what traffic have we got? What are we getting? What is getting stuff? And where the heck is everything now in analytics? Uh, is it engagement? Pages? Overview. Actually, I think I've just had it on pages and screens. Clean the code, okay. So, the traffic is coming from the main traffic sources. I mean, if we just go top 10. Uh, There's no entrances, but so there's the manifestation one, uh, the drawing. What can you learn or look up with your knowledgeable mind? What is that? Is that in manifestation? What is that page then? Look up. Okay, what what is this one? I wanna, you used to be able to click and actually view the page. What can you learn or oh, look up is two words, that why it maybe didn't come up. Okay, is that a page then?
How bizarre. So where where is that page? Anyone got any ideas? Why can't I just click it? What have they done to analytics? I love change. Oh. Okay, anyway, let's let's move on. I don't know where that page is, but it's got 79 visits. Is it the homepage title? <laughs> thank you. Yeah, thank you. It is the homepage. Thank you, Bradbury. Manifestation, manifestation, board, drawing, manifestation, resources, how to draw. Okay, so it looks like drawing... But I don't, I'm gonna ditch the drawing. I don't wanna do the drawing. I'm thinking what I'm gonna do, let's go back in. What I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna keep the manifestation stuff. Everything else, we'll, we'll, we'll get it. What am I clicking? I don't know, I'm clicking everything. Everything else can, can go, I can park it. I'm gonna draft it, draft all of these. So yeah, I have just wasted five minutes cleaning up that, that glasses thing, but hey. No, we won't move to trash, we'll just draft them for now. What? Now I'm gonna have to keep the drawing, I like, really? What is the hardest? thing to draw. Okay, yeah, yeah. Hmm, interesting. In the world. Why am I on the dark theme now? What, what happened? Okay. Got rid of it though, didn't I? <sighs> um, there's 20 articles on the site, Sean. Do you think I should keep the drawing ones there maybe? It is ranking well. Let's have a look at this article. It's not a good article though, is it? It's not really very good. Hey, the boss is in the house. Oh, that's a nice doggy. Yeah, maybe I'll do what Dana says, bury them. How much traffic? Well, if we look, 191 last 28 days, oh sorry, 204. People only stay 23 seconds. I'm getting rid of it. I don't want I don't want to do drawing. This site is going to be focused on the mystical stuff, the manifestation and that kind of thing, numerology. Because I want to sell some ClickBank products and things on here too. Is there is there drawing ClickBank? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Uh... That's what she said, Steve. 
He's playing that little game. What's that game called where you have to look at the thing? Um, drawing. How to draw cars fast and easy? Secrets of drawing. Pencil drawing. How to draw animals. Yeah, I'm gonna ditch the drawing. I'm gonna I'm gonna make a judgment on that and yeah, ditching the drawing. For now. So what do we got left? He had a um, what did he, he had an affirmation site, didn't he, Adrian? I did some affirmation stuff as well. I didn't do very well, but never mind. So yeah, drawing ticks. I mean, really, what what are we doing with ticks with any ticks? Ah, uh, did he? Thing is, I do actually know someone who's really into numerology and they're like a bit of an expert, so they might be able to help me with some content on that one. Then we've got writing. We'll draft that one up. So that leaves us with and yeah, I'm gonna all these drafts. I'm gonna set them a date a long time ago because they're getting in my way. Oh god, I can't click on anything. Okay, well, maybe not too much numerology then. Is manifestation and numerology a YMYL? You and Steve, Sean and Steve, they're on the same wavelength. Look at that. They're manifesting stuff together. Um, is it not a quick edit on the dates? Ugh. Do it one by one. Actually, no, maybe I can do it this uh, No. Do it that way. No. Yeah, I doubt it is your money or your life. It's not like it's not like a real science, is it? <laughs> cool. You're featured in the new video that me and Daryl are working on. You sent him a, a fantastic testimonial, didn't you, or an email or something? Hey, Coop. I didn't realize that you came via Daryl's video. Coo, is that how you found me? I'm not gonna be covering depression and anxiety, am I? I'm talking about how to use the universe to attract things and numerology is like, I don't even know what that is, but it's something to do with numbers. Another t-shirt idea there from Adrian. Stop worrying about YMYL. That's what that needs to go on a t-shirt, doesn't it? Okay. Right, so now we've got 11 posts to play with. The one that really is pulling in the traffic right now is this bad boy. So we should probably do this one first in terms of the tidy up. Should we have a read? Many people on this planet have at least one goal set for themselves regarding their health, finances, love life. One goal? I need to stop leaning on my elbow. 
A part of us seeks to do better and have more. However, the process of that ideal destination is a road full of unpredictable situations, obstacles, blessings, and delays. In the preservation of your inspiration, God, there's a lot of words in here. And in the preservation of your inspiration and will, it is important to stay focused on the desired outcome. Some signs and indications will guide you in how to know your manifestation is about to happen. Then we've got a lovely big pin. When is the right time to get realistic when manifesting? These articles aren't very good, are they? You still haven't answered my question. It doesn't tell me when I know my manifestation is about to happen. Surely there's a sign. You see like a crow fly above your head or something. Oh, hang on. Are these the points? Stepping stones. Oh, God. It's a... I'm going to have to get my writers on this, I think. What is the Google NLP API? Anyway, I'm going to clean this up anyway. We'll, we'll clean it up because we should clean it up. And I'll get the rewrite done sometime soon. I think we need more social icons, don't we? I'm going to clean this up, but then I'll have a look at the home page. See how that works. Eagle fly, exactly, Sue. That's who's manifesting. Someone out there is manifesting something. All right. Where's word? Oh no, words weren't any question. Let's get in here. Get get out of here. Convert it to blocks. Perfect. How do you know when your manifestation is about to happen? So if I want to add an image to the right here, to can I do that? Is that is that easy with this? Can I uh like just like get my Pinterest? Um where is it? Though actually look at this. How do you know when your manifestation is about to happen? And then let's continue to not answer that question at all. So yeah, can I slip this to the right? Is there, is there a way to do that? Move to? Yeah. Bye-bye, mm. Sean. I'm sure there is a way to... Add stuff to the right, is there not? I this, but I want it to wrap around the the text. I do that. Oh, oh look, there we go. I've done something there. Can I make this smaller? But dragging, no, I can't drag. Of course, we can't drag. Do you think this is thrive? Um, let's just do that. Preview this. Okay. That looks better already. You can drag it. You can drag it. Small. Okay. Can you? Oh, yeah, look. Ah. Gutenberg? All is forgiven. Sorry. Sorry, I doubted you. This needs a bit of paragraphs. Yeah, this this whole thing needs re rewriting, man. Um, actually, I don't know if this because I need to put a heading here now, and it, where can I put my heading? Can I put it here? 
Oh, maybe I can. What does that look like? Hmm, down there. Uh, okay, I'm gonna get rid of that Pinterest because it's, it's not very good anyway. <laughs> it's not very good anyway, is it? It doesn't answer the question. We'll come back to that. We'll think of something to do with that. It's gonna be a lot of copying and pasting. And look, man, these people, they don't know. Where's the paragraphs at? I mean, I'm not even reading this, but I'm guessing there should be paragraphs around that kind of space. Should we add the image of the mystical clocks? I don't know. Mystical clocks, where are you? Gotta be careful how you say that. There. Cool, yeah, yeah, you're in the next video. Gutenberg will kill a lot of page builders. Yeah, poor old Elementor. They've just put their prices up as well. What can you expect from time and its relationship to manifestation? You can't expect a lot from time apart from it will keep ticking. Why is that heading different? Don't know. We'll figure it out. I guess these are different headings. We'll go for H3 on these ones. Yep. If one of your goals is to have ripped abs, then you must understand that there is a process. Our physical bodies are truly unique. Therefore, we can approach situations like this with the expectations of receiving a fast result as if we were to put an order in at our favorite fast food chain. These matters are investments we make in ourselves, which have great power. So don't ignore those. Oh, my. Wow. Brizzy is Daryl's favorite thing. I, yeah, I'm going to have to. I'm going to go till about half three. I wanted to go till four, but I've. I've got to finish editing the video that I'm doing with Daryl. I did say I'd have it for him today, so I probably should try and get it finished. I want some abs. I'm going to sell it, Koo. I think. Some signs include... So like, here's the actual answer to the article. This article does need rejigging. So I guess, what should we do a heading four? I'm getting a bit low down the heading numbers. These things should probably be near the top to be fair, because that's actually answering the question. There is too many images. We'll add some images maybe at the end, but. You don't use Elementor, no. Um, Dana told me I have to use Gutenberg. That's what we're doing. This site doesn't have Elementor. We, we want a nice fast site anyway, so Elementor's a slow old thing, isn't it? You will be tested. I can't believe that there's 52 of you right now watching me just copying and pasting. I do appreciate it. We're gonna get onto some other, something else in two seconds. I'm not gonna do this on every um, article. I'm gonna I'm gonna get Mac to do it. Or indeed, I'm just gonna get them rewritten and published as a fresh, and then do some freer ones or something. I don't wanna mess up the traffic that it's already getting though. Have you ever followed what your intuition towards, have you ever followed your intuition towards what you want? Yes, you should always follow your intuition. Oh, this was a H3, that, that style, wasn't it? Got a lot of heading numbers. I need to probably think about this. Yeah, that needs more paragraphs as well, but hey, whatever. Uh, 
Yeah, there was a compar I have seen, uh, Bradbury, I've seen that comparison thing between different page builders, but it turned out that the guy who did it was the um, the oxygen guy, so I don't know how accurate it is. Obviously he loves to show how fast his oxygen builder is. Kudi, you're very honest. I appreciate your honesty. Or is it Kudi Y? Want to learn more about manifestation? Yes, please. Thank you for your time. We don't need to thank you for your time at the end of each article. I don't think we do anyway. Perfect. Beautiful. We, we got there in the end. It does scare me, Josh, but I'm, I've got Phil, he's gonna help me. Post, let's have a look at it. Looks all right, doesn't it? Looks all right. Looks all right. It's beautiful. Now this top bit, let's have a look at this home page then. Home page needs a little bit of work. So this, I thought we could go for some cool brand, well not cool branding, just branding kind of. I don't like, the word is too big, knowledgeable mind, too big for me. So I was just gonna change that to this. Is CSS knowledge needed for auction? I believe it is, Jason. No, oh God. I can't click, I can't even use a mouse today. Phil, is, is CSS needed for oxygen? Okay. So how on earth does this homepage work? Let's have a look. Customize. Now, of course, we could look at the documentation that came with the theme, but I've already looked at it. I looked at it the other day and it's, it's written by a techie person as a lot of them often are because themes are made by techie people. So we've done all this stuff. And you know, I don't like to look at instructions unless I get really stuck. So what we got here, homepage settings. I'm pretty sure it should be set to your latest posts. That looks better, doesn't it? Yo, yes, a flex. That's up to you, Koo, but I'd carry on on your first site. You should be starting to see something happen with 100 posts. What's happened to this one? What, what, have I broken? What, what, what's that one? What's wrong with that one? Oh no, they're fine. Beautiful, beautiful. And get rid of that. I've got too many tabs on the go as usual. We'll kill out some of these, get rid of them. Okay, so what have we got going on on this homepage? Uh, Roku, rookie. Oh my, there's a lot of settings here. Lot of settings. Eesh. Okay, we won't mess with him. Homepage settings. Post loop display type, default or custom post blocks. We've got masonry, we've got grid. Grid is very gritty, isn't it? To be fair, it doesn't look too bad as it is, does it? It doesn't look too bad. It doesn't look too bad. I like this 
Oh, it's gone. I like this five minute read thing. How come some have got that and not all of them? Oh, and how come, oh, we've got like a doubling up of the posts here, haven't we? Uh, I'm gonna go for custom post blocks. See what we can do with that. I'm gonna have to look at the instructions in a minute, maybe. Uh, okay. Post blocks, okay, here we go, post block. Enable block. Hey, look, there we go. What should we call this? Popular posts. Okay, and we'll go popular posts. Hmm. Don't know if they are the popular posts because not going to analytics, they're not. Read time, I love read time. What What's this one here? Like, what is this top bit? What is this? How do I get turn this off? Okay, featured posts, home featured posts. Ah, okay, so this is the, f what is this at the top then? Is that the latest post maybe? Don't know. That's fine. The blocks seem to be good because then you can go through and you can adjust the columns. You know, you can have a two column or a one column. Like that then. We don't need too many. The problem is you can't reorganize them. That's the only trouble. In fact, I'd like the first one to be recent posts, I think. And I'd like it to be um, like six and three. Okay. I mean, once I start adding lots of categories, I guess then I'll just do it by category. I will do that in a minute. Phil. Um, then this one can be popular posts. Popular. Then we'll go. Um, we'll go two column. Perfect. Perfect. I'm, I'm happy with that for now. Let's do it. Shopping time. Where the heck are you going shopping? You can't go out. We're on lockdown, man. Everything seems to be a five minute read, doesn't it? Oh well. And um, this doesn't have the read time and I want the read time, I love that. I don't know why, but I do. It's quite a lot to do, isn't there? Let's have a look at some more settings. What have we got? Hero settings. Ah, okay, that's the hero. I could be a hero, baby. We'll do that as random because it's always going to mess with that. It's always going to be the same. Mind blowing facts about humans that might surprise you. Learn about humans. Wow. What we could we could crank this up to free. Mm, no, I, just, I thought it was going to do like a slider thing. What, what is this? Don't know. Give me some read time though, I'll take that. <laughs> Jason says, I like the Acabado theme. Acabado, Acabado. We don't know how to say any words. But it's a bit boring, in it, in it. 
that sticky about it on the right doesn't appeal and I think you can get similar speeds with GPU Asher. Yeah, I think that Acabado is a bit dull. Social media. Ah, look, there's all them post shares things. We don't need all these, do we? We need Twitter, Facebook, Pinterest. Not that. 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 Perfect. What else we got? Related posts. Yes, please. I'm gonna have this as you might like. Beautiful. Brino, Brino, Brino. Oh, you've stirred the eagle, Brino. Brino. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I think we've made a bit of an impact. The one thing we need to do, though, is we need to get the AdSense back on somehow, don't we? How we? Let's do the AdSense. Should we do the AdSense? Because I've taken the ads off. I've still got a lot of articles to clean up. A lot of cleaning up to do. But the one we did clean up, looking mighty fine. Should we run it for a speed test as well? Should we do that? I think we should. Let's go to Google page speed score and just have a look. We could put, we got WP Rocket installed, so we can turn that. We should turn that back on, probably. They are. All right, we're getting 67 and we're getting a 94. That's pretty good. Yeah, well, these paragraphs aren't too bad. Some of them are a little bit long still. Definitely needs a little bit of editing. So that's pretty good speed, actually. Let's get the, uh, the plugin back on. Yeah, well done, Ku. 120 visits a day, few sales. Hello, Journey James. I didn't I didn't welcome you properly into the WP Eagler crew. Um the other day when you joined. Welcome. You're a little egg at the moment, but you will hatch into a powerful eagle. This is all is this all on? This is fine. This is all good. Is this all good? Everything's ticked up. Well, let's run it again. What is the Google Passages update? What is that? I did see Carl talked about it. What is it? What is it? I want to see an example. I'll read that later, too many words. Seventy eight that's actually gone down. But they're good scores anyway, they're fine. Nine five. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> Thank you, Journey James. Right, yeah, let's get them ads done. Let's get the ads on. I, there was a plugin that I turned off, so maybe if I just turn it back on. This one. Anyone used WP quads before? It sounds like um, 
some sort of exercise. Okay, there, there's these things. Let's see. Is there any ads now? Let's see. Hey, there's an ad. Okay, there's an ad. There's an ad. Free ads, perfect. Beautiful. Subliminal hypnosis. There's no ads on here though. Oh, though there is an ad. Text in. So there we go. I mean, we've got the ads on. We've got the site looking nice. Um, we're going to be doing manifestation. Let's see if we get some ideas for keywords on that. Uh, manifestation. I can't spell it. Man, if, no, you can't spell it. You're not looking at it properly. Hard. It does look goof. Oh, you mean good. <laughs> How to set an intention for manifestation. Let's have a look at the competitors. I've seen this one before. Looks good, looks good. I'll have to copy it. <laughs> what is current jelly stool a clinical manifestation of what the... What, what, I don't even want to know what that is or what it means or what on earth is going on with that. How to create a manifestation board. Empowering vision board. Jack Canfield. Nah, this guy, he was in the secret, wasn't he? He was. He's living off the secret. He knows all about it. Okay, I think we could do, there's some things here. How to get manifestation of zeal. I don't know, things, I don't know what a lot of these things are. How to write that, that's a keyword that we've already targeted, haven't we? Pretty sure of that. Um, pretty sure we have. Although it's not first page, so. A film on the secret on Netflix. Is there? The film is good. The film is good. Definitely. Oh. Two times go. Yeah. Ah, yeah, this one. Yeah, this is it. Watch it, it's good. So me putting Netflix up, I've probably then just done a copyright strike again, haven't I? That's two in one stream. It's very cheesy. There's like a bit of, there's a kid, I think I'm trying to remember, there's a kid, he wants a bike and he's drawing a picture of his bike. He's doing a manifestation visionary board or whatever. And then he looks up and da -da, there's the bike. I wonder what answer the public says on this. I will be, I'll be telling you the lottery numbers. You're looking at what I'm typing, it's eerie. It's it's pretty cheesy. It's more mature than mild, I'd say. Can manifestation work overnight? Wow, look at all this stuff that we can write about. Can manifestation work overnight? No, not really, probably not. A 
And then here, here's the guide, how to manifest anything overnight. The simple answer is yes. Fantastic, what do you want tomorrow? We, you can have whatever you want tomorrow, you just gotta do it overnight. She's got an ultimate guide on manifesting. I think the millennial grind is gonna be the one to beat, isn't she? The one to beat. Can manifesting make you tired? I'm well aware that I'm using up a lot of keywords everywhere credits. <laughs> Can manifesting make you tired? There's not an article on this one, is there? I think a load of short answer kind of articles, or maybe I'll do an ultimate guide of manifesting and answer some of these things. Answer Socrates. Ah, okay. I keep forgetting about this. You must remind me of this site every day, Phil. Ooh, look at all these. So these guys are basically gonna be taking Answer the Public's business away, aren't they? For sure, because it's basically the same but free. Which manifestation indicates tertiary syphilis? How long do manifestations take? That sounds like a good one. Okay, then we'll be on, we'll be okay. Anyway. Manifestation buddy. Wow. I think we've done all right, let's have one final look. So here's the new site. And um, yeah, I just need to do a bit of a content plan. I need to tidy up the existing content. Um, I'm going to switch it over to Ezoic as well, very shortly. It's kind of already signed up with Ezoic. I just need to add it. So that will increase some earnings. And uh, yeah, there we go. But yeah, I'm going to love you and leave you now because I do need to finish an edit I'm doing for Daryl Wilson. He's got a new video that he's hoping to get out, includes me. That was the video where I recorded a good hour's worth of stuff realized that the mic was up well too high and had a load of, um, what do you call it when your audio is messed up like that? Drop off, not drop off. You know, when you flatten your waves and you basically sound all blah, 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 too close to the mic like a, a wedding singer, a wedding DJ. That, that was the problem. Yeah, it's distortion, there's another word, clipping. Clipping, yeah. So that was annoying. But thankfully, I managed to buy a D clipper, a D clipper. So that should that's kind of helped it a bit. I do have a pop filter. I've got one up there. It was no, it wasn't just a pop filter. It was that the mic, the input was too high, so the computer just couldn't handle it. it was too loud, so all the waveforms were like flat at the top and the bottom. Biggity biggity bong! Well, that was fun. We we turned the site around. I think it looks better. Do you think it looks better? I think I need to... Well, I don't know. What do you think I should do with it? That site. What would, what would you think? Is it worth me adding a load more content, sorting out the YouTube channel, working on the Pinterest. The Pinterest gets quite a lot of traffic. Or should I just slap Ezoic on it and sell it <laughs> as it is? 
I think I could spend a little time with it, maybe spend a thousand dollars on it or something like that. Chuck a load of manifestation content and a few other bits and bobs around that kind of stuff. Astrology maybe, maybe numerology, Reiki, all that stuff, I don't know. And it can be like a new age kind of site and sell it for 60 grand. That's a hundred times return. I don't know. Ku says, when is the video coming out? I don't know. I'm going to try and get the edit done today and then I'll send it back to Daryl and then he'll do some more editing and go, what the heck have you done to the sound probably? And then, then he'll put it up. Keep it for a year. Okay. Give it away. <laughs> Says Jenny James. Um, No, we're not giving it away. Well, maybe I should give it. No, I'm not giving it away. I probably shouldn't have given away swim signs if I'm honest. Now I think about it, because the tutorial for swim signs is quite a popular video, and now when people go and look at the site, it looks quite different to to the one I built in the tutorial. Ugh, never mind. Well. Speaking of Best Roofbox and selling Best Roofbox, I did get made an offer on Best Roofbox by someone who I trust and know quite well. So I was tempted. But I'm also thinking that Best Roofbox 2021 is going to be the year for Best Roofbox as we get into summer, as we get rid of COVID a, a bit, hopefully, and we're allowed out, maybe camping or just to go out on the road, thinking that this year could be the year for Best Roofbox. So I don't know. <laughs> Everyone's just trying to encourage me to give it away. That's because you want it, don't you? You want to manifest your own site. Really curious why you would draft all the articles when they're ranking and earnings from ads so early in your rebuild. Well, the thing is, I like cruise ships. They are ranking. I mean, they're getting a trickle of traffic that one we looked at the most popular drawing one pulled in 90 or something visits was it over the last 28 days that's going to be a good 10 cents of earnings whatever but as we've decided together as a collective this afternoon i don't want to do drawing articles and i think the site was spreading itself too thin in terms of the content lots of random content i want to focus the site a little bit more and those drawing articles just don't fit and they're not very good articles either. So it's best to get rid of them now. The trickle of traffic, you know, I'll take it or leave it, whatever. Should probably have redirected them actually, shouldn't I? Yeah, never mind. That's what we'll do, Ku. I like your plan. You you're you're on my wavelength. We'll do a bit of work on it and we'll sell it for a hundred K. Make a video about it. Be fine. Ishmael, which subtitle are you thinking about just ripping off people's um, videos and turning them into articles? Like just, or, or are they your own videos? Oh, as Jason asks, are they your videos? I mean, there's nothing wrong with, for sure, creating a video, taking a transcript, creating an article, and, you know, making good use out of a bit of content. You know, you work once and then you can make four or five bits of content, a video, podcast, article, that's free, I'm trying to think of two more. <sighs> Sip tea and drink bounties. Talking of chocolate, look at this. I got this for the wife for Valentine's Day, but I'm actually thinking I might have some of it myself. Let's have a look. Just before I go. Let's have a look at this box. Very big, very big. Oh. oh, look at this. Look at this. What an unboxing this is. Oh. 
got the uh, obligatory Valentines. But look, because the lady loves. Actually, I can't get that out. But there's a huge box of milk tray. Look at this. Oh, it's a big one. Oh yeah. Oh, I want to eat it now. What else we got? There was actually a box of 42 cream eggs in here as well, but I've, I've already taken that out. I've got to work on that. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Is that it? Oh, no, 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 there's more. There's more. Oh, there's a custom one, like a Valentine's one. Beautiful. I don't know. Uh, actually, there's not as much as I thought. It's a lot of, a lot of packaging. Mostly, it was those cream eggs. Yeah, maybe I'll, I'll get to work on it. I've messed it all up now. It looks a mess now. Hang on. Let's just to rearrange it a little bit. Get some of this. Ah, ah. Let's get it out of here. <laughs> so when is it? Sunday, isn't it? Sunday. Yeah. I am going to eat it probably. I do sometimes call myself the wife. What dollar were you offered for the um, for best report? I was offered thirty one thousand dollars. So not bad. Oh. Oh. Sorry if you saw my fat back then. So yeah, yeah, yeah. They're not your videos. Well, I'd, I'd be careful ripping off people's videos then and turning them into articles. If you could only build with one site builder, which would it be? Oh, that's a tricky one. I'd probably build with Elementor. Cheaper and flexible. Though I do like Thrive. <laughs> 31K, not enough. 31K, noise. I didn't think it was enough either. I mean, if you take the the income, it's it does do about a thousand a month. You do a thirty x on it, thirty grand, isn't it? But it's earning a thousand a month in winter, in the middle of a COVID pandemic. So I think we're kind of at the bottom. Less than a hundred k. Okay, I like it, Phil. I'm I'll go with that. I'm not taking the offer, no. I politely said that I'm going to hold it for a few more months. <laughs> I understand that, Sui. I mean, it's hard. You order them, you get ahead of yourself, you do some planning, and then before you know it, it's just gone. And it wasn't even... Pounds coup, it was dollars, and which is only like 24,000 pounds. My response, Ishmael, was don't rip off other people's YouTube videos or videos in general. Sure, turn your own videos into articles from the subtitles, but you know, taking other people's videos, taking their subtitles, turning them into articles, I don't think you should. I wouldn't do it. Hey, I thought you might have done. I can't. No trousers anyway. Hoddle. Anyway, I said I was going to go, so I am. Five, four, three, two. My fingers, two, one. I'll be back on Tuesday. Um, I've got a video for you next week. I had a chat with uh, Mark from Niche Website Builders. We had a good chat about link building. He shared some really good ideas and thoughts and tips. So I'll have that for you. And yeah, I'm going to probably look at Nitro Nitro Pack on Best Roof Box. See if we can get that Google Core Speed thingy up. 
And yeah, I'm going to do some work on Knowledgeable Mind. I'm, I'm putting a kind of rolling diary video together on that. So um, that'll be done when it's done. All right, until next time, see you later.